Good morning from Panhandle Outdoors, America's only daily outdoor TV show. Your source for fishing, hunting, and information for folks who enjoy the great outdoors. Now sit back, relax. It's Panhandle Outdoors. All right, Panhandle Outdoors. On the road in Andalusia, Alabama. At a Holiday Inn, but we're headed for the woods. Hey, buddy. You ready to roll? I'm going to be really ready to roll to get under your business. <laughs> we'll start with the fella, Michael Harris. Good morning. Good morning. You ready to roll? Yes, sir. Tell folks where we are. We're in Andalusia, Alabama. Way up here. Yes, How cold is it this morning? 29. Okay. Uh, who all we got with us? We got a, all right, we got to start over here. Hi, I'm Steve Hall. Steve, where are you from? Uh, Santa Rosa Beach, Florida. All right, we got a lot of viewers in Santa Rosa. Yep. My Calhoun County neighbors. That's for Joseph Hall. All <laughs> right. Florida. Up there in Clarksville? Alpha. Alpha. That's Cl Clifford Newsom. And my grandson, Britt, head behind me here. <laughs> and we have something in common. What is that? School board. You're on the school board of Calhoun County. That's correct. All right. You excited this morning? Yes, sir. All right, young man. Hi, my name is Jace, and I live in Clarksville. In Clarksville? I don't know where that is. That, you excited this morning? Yeah! <laughs> hey, Craig lives in Clarksville, Florida. All right, here are our local boys coming up. We're going to go meet some of the Alabama boys. And... All right, we all meet at a pick and save in Andalusia. It's a frosty morning. Coming all the way down from South Carolina. Doing his youth hunt. Now, what was your name? Braylon. And where are you from? I'm from Vernon. I know where that is. We got some viewers in Vernon. <laughs> you from Vernon? Fort Walton. Fort Walton. Fort Walton. Let's Fort go Walton back and take Fort Walton. I thought you said Vernon. <laughs> Fort She's like burning for that's, that's close. Uh, All right, now who, now who we got here now? We got Brad, but uh, Raphael Cratch. Raphael, now where are you from? I'm uh, originally from North Carolina. All right. I live in Crestview now. It's a pleasure to be okay. here. Okay. Brian Fedor from Baker, Florida. Baker. Yes, sir. Hunter, Hunter Campbell from Laurel Hill. Laurel Hill. Then Baker won the state championship this year. Yes, sir. All right. Uh -huh. Good little old football team. Yeah, I, I followed them. Yeah, yeah. Okay, we got uh, Michael and I up here at the camp. Now you can see the crowd. That's the other one up over here. I bet there's a fire somewhere. Our, the main man, Brad. <laughs> Buddy, how you doing? Doing good. How are you? All right, tell us what's going on here. Well, it's uh, cold. I don't know if you can see the. It's very cold. So we're kind of we're eating. Uh, we've met up there in Andalusia. Uh, our kind of folks have gotten breakfast ready. Everybody's eating breakfast. We're now they're collaring up the the beagles and getting ready to to uh, get after it again for another annual. Showdown. This, this is the sixth annual or yeah, sixth annual youth yeah. hunt. Yeah, you've been on what? I've been a couple of them. And it's just always special to see all these folks. Uh, and now tell this, this hunt club what, where we are now. This is this right here. We're actually in the, uh, outside of Andalusia, between Andalusia and Brooklyn. We have about 3,000 acres on this club that we uh, generally uh, still hunting, uh, but small game. You know, we've small game hunted it for a while, and, or every year that we can. So. But uh, but yeah, this this is where it's our 
Well, I know everybody's ex- We got a perfect morning, too. Yes. I mean, beautiful morning. All right, we I know. Got, we got uh, Buck down from the Carolinas here. Hey, a Buck? Yeah, yeah. Tell, us, tell us your story. You all come on with you from South Carolina? Me and my brother, my little girl Lila, my nephew Wyatt. You know, we can't wait to get on some rabbits. I ain't rabbit hunting in a long time. <laughs> y'all can check us out at Carolina Crazy Outdoors on YouTube. So you got a YouTube channel? Oh, yeah. All right, yeah. this would be awesome. That'd Brad be... got me down here a few months ago and I killed a deer. Yeah. Oh, you did? Yeah, sure did. That'll you then, because every time you come on a trip, you don't get a deer. But... <laughs> That's right. <laughs> it wasn't like four or five kilo when I got one of them. Yeah, we spoke about that the night before. He just wanted to get some good yep. footage of, uh, just kind of like what you did uh-huh. at Bear Creek, you know, get a little footage of, of uh, tracking system. Yeah. You know, the dogs uh, running but actually the new technology and I don't know the whole day fell into I mean, it was a it, it was, was like a great day couldn't have been no better that's awesome yep. really that's awesome tell, hey, tell folks who you are um, Jackson Lewis now you can drive a four wheeler can't you I, I remember last time you driving through the mud and who we have here and, okay are you excited got the crew here hi good morning What's your name? Jay. What'd you do last time you were here? What did you? I killed a buck. Yep. Awesome. The youth hunt. Awesome. Yep, this year, Jay's. This yeah. is his first year of hunting in it. Good deal. Yep. This is great. Y'all ready? Ready. Yes, <laughs> <laughs> I got eight eleven. Bolt action. Down this road. Food plot. Yeah. We'll probably put one of y'all on the food plot down there, and then somebody on this road right here, and then somebody on this road right here, and then we'll have pretty much all the stuff. Let one of them older girls go to that cute better go to the good place. <laughs> but I'd, I'd probably put her, put her on the plot. That way, she have a change. Yeah, she will have more open spot. I mean, he's going to be in the road, right? Yeah. We don't run, we don't get off. And she wear everything. And it's pretty open. It's pretty open down this road anyway. So, but there's, I have rabbits on camera on both sides. So. Make sure you're shooting right. Because we don't want no dogs or nobody shot. Well, this is our first hunt this morning. Yes, we're going to have a girl hunt? Absolutely. Right. This, Absolutely. Well, this is where you started That's off. That's right. Now, go over our names. Kaylee. And where are you from? Laurel uh, Hill, Florida. Laurel Hill. My name is Jade and I'm from Baker, Florida. Baker? Yes, sir. My name is Bristol and I'm from Laurel Hill. All right. Some North Florida girls. All right. We got them, back. We got them ready? Yes, sir. Ready, All right. Here we go. This is. Look at here, folks. You want to see some beagles? Woo! <laughs> you saying they ready to go? <laughs> Lord, look at that, folks. Come on here, come on here, come on here. If that don't get you excited, I don't know what will. All right, we got dogs up there in the woods. Girls, girls what kind of guns y'all shooting? What are you shooting? I'm shooting a, a Winchester. Winchester. Okay. A Remington. A Remington or Winchester. 12 gauge? Yep. Yes, sir. All right. My papa's old gun. Is it? That's special.
Come on. Honey, Come on, in here. Come on, get him up. Come on, Whitney. Come on, Simon. Whitney. 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 Come on. Come on, Whit. Come on, Jesse. Come on, Sue. Come on. Come on, here, get him up. Where you at? Come on. Come on. Are you on your phone? While you're rabbit hunting, you're on your phone? Yeah. I got a video of it. Oh. <laughs> that way I can make a Facebook post. Oh. <laughs> okay. Come on, man, you go back up here behind the van. Alright, buddy, run it. We got two. Raphael, what does that mean? It means he saw one, so he's calling the dogs. The dogs know that he, he saw a rabbit. He turned. I'll be doggone. He come all the way up to here and turned. Yeah, he turned. Doggone it. All right, here. And Whitney. All right, here's the present situation. The rabbit's in a hole. Did you see the rabbit? You were up on the hill. What happened? Yes, sir. I turned around and it was crossing the road. And then the dogs were coming back around making a look. Okay. And he came up right next to us, and, and you said, and when we missed him, you said, oh, what? Oh, darn. Oh, darn. Oh, darn. <laughs> <laughs> That's how close we've been. But right now, he's in a hole.
Ralph, you trying to get him up? All right, so how do y'all get them out of the hole? Say that again. Well, a lot of times we'll take a, what, what we call a wait a minute vine. It's got a lot of thorns on it. We'll stick that vine down in the hole, twist it, pull that rabbit out of the hole. Okay. Well, he did. He came. He went across the road and came back. All right. Tell the story. Yeah. Okay, tell the story, girls. What happened? I was close to y'all. The rabbit crossed the road, and then I tally hoed them in back into the woods, and then they made a loop and came right back in. And then I was standing there, ready, and Kayla said, There it is. <laughs> so which one shot? Kaylee did. You shot it? Yes, sir. And one shot. One shot. Tell them again what you say you did when you say. I tally hoed them. My dad Ta raised me right. Tell the folks what tally ho is. Getting them where the rabbit is. <laughs> Telling them here it was. <laughs> Congratulations. Thanks, Hold them up there. Let's see. All right, finally got them. Yay. <laughs> All right, lunchtime at the camp. I'm gonna give me a hot dog. <laughs> lunchtime up here in Andalusia at, what's the name of the camp? <laughs> you can't wear the camp up here. We're on a rabbit hunt and y'all see what I'm eating. Okay. Got some hot dogs and nacho chili cheese. Hot dogs, nacho chili, and everybody found the camp. All right, don't move it that fast. Go slow. Oh. We gotta always move it slow. <laughs> we got a new cameraman here. Yep. Nothing speaks hunting camp more than getting on the truck. Right. That's this is hunting camp. Yep. That's a fact. Well, thank y'all again so much for your hospitality. Thank you for Absolutely. coming. This is. Glad y'all can make it. Y'all, this is awesome doing this with this many kids. Thank you. Job. Liberty, wave that fella right there. Can you wave? Can you say hi? Hello. Wave. Liberty. Liberty. You wave. You wave. You say hi. Oh, you got back. <laughs> now, what are you doing? I'm getting some animal crackers. I'll go and get you some animal crackers. <laughs> animal crackers. Where y'all from? Um. Uh, Milton. Milton? Yes. All right, y'all having fun today? Yes, sir. Good deal. Well, the animal cracker is good on it. <laughs> <laughs> She, um, yeah, you're good. Yeah, you're good. No, I don't get it. Yeah, I'm going to break out. I don't want to see it. Y'all been deep up around. Yeah, I'll leave you. Y'all got it going on with that. I don't know that. Stand up, Jace. 
Okay, everybody headed out on a skeet shoot. They're going to shoot skeet and try to have one more hunt. We're going to we're going to head on out. Everybody together one more time. Okay, Michael and Brad, another great successful youth hunt coming to a close. Yes, sir. Y'all had a great turnout. Yep, we had a very good turnout this year, Coach. Uh, was the sixth sixth year we were doing we've done this? Yes, sixth annual. Yep, it's a huge success. We're actually going to shoot some skeet right now, but uh, it's uh, growing bigger and bigger thanks to WFF uh, for helping out with this. Um, the you know seasons of hope, obviously, mm -hmm. and then uh, Southeastern Dog Hunter Association, Alabama Dog Hunter Association, Covington County up. chapter, um, NSD. But uh, very successful hunt and getting kids involved. Uh, again, this is why I wish I was telling somebody a while ago. Wish everybody in America was doing this on a Saturday afternoon. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> all right, guys. Thank y'all so much for doing this. Thank you for coming. Absolutely. Thank you. Thanks for watching. All right. Good morning, Panhandle Outdoors. <laughs> Thanks for watching America's only daily outdoor TV show, Panhandle Outdoors with Winston Chester. Featuring hunting, fishing, and other activities and information to help you enjoy the great outdoors. Join us next time for Panhandle Outdoors.